I love gettingthemix.com. Jeremy here from Get in, uh, Get in the Mix Total Music as well. Um, we're at NAMM 2013 uh, in Anaheim, California. Thanks very much for watching. Um, here's Adrian from Focus Right. Can you give a quick rundown on the Mini Nova? Thanks, Adrian. All right. What have we got on here? So, this is our new Mini Nova synth. And if you're familiar with us at all, then you're familiar with our Ultra Nova synth. And this actually features the same synth engine as the Ultra Nova. So, it's actually a, a Mini Keys version. Um, so it's got a 37 note mini keys, uh, mini synth action key bed, um, unlike the um, main ultra rubber. And um, some of the cool things about this are basically the big sound you can get out of it because it is exactly the same synth engine. So we have a bit of software that goes along with it, you don't have to use it, but if you're using a DAW or something like that, you can just use the software as a plugin. Um, and actually edit all of the um, synth sounds uh, in a very deep way um, like you can with a, a, a bigger synth. So one of the coolest things about this synth are the kind of ease with which you can get around it. All of the performance controls are right there on the front panel. So things like the big filter knob, you've got all your most common uh, performance controls up here which you can just use this selector switch to go through them and then use these dials to change that. We've also got this really cool animate and arpeggiate section. Um, so this has got two, two functions. In arpeggiate mode, we'll switch that on, start the arpeggiator going. You can see it actually runs through an arp sequence there um, for whatever chord or whatever notes that I'm playing. And this technology is similar to our Novation um, impulse keyboard in that I can actually warp the arpeggio and turn the notes on and off in real time. So for performance, for changing the sounds and things like that, this is a really, really cool option. The other section here, the animate section, pop it over there. We've basically got these eight pads again, and each one actually triggers an effect. So you can put uh, what's called an effect slot. Um, <clears throat> using the software or using the controls on here, it'll actually put an effect in each one. So you can use the arpeggiator and the animate mode together to create all sorts of crazy, uh, crazy new sounds. Um, it's also got a updated vocoder in it as well, so we ship this in the box. Um, the vocoder is, um, <clears throat> again, it's similar to the engine in this, but we've actually updated it and added a few things like vocal tune, which will actually uh, pitch correct your vocals in real time. It sounds really, really nice. Um, finally, I'll just show you this um, patch edit, patch browser we've got here, so you can sort all of the um, all of the sounds which you can edit yourself or store in the librarian and use this to select all of just the bass sounds or all of the lead sounds or if you want all of the sounds that um, that are kind of R&B and hip hop or rock and pop you can just use this to filter your um, your searches so it's much easier to find what you want um, that's the video. Fantastic, thanks very much. Here we go, Jeremy at uh, NAM 2013, Adrian showing us the Mini Nova, thanks very much.